Hello friends, Mr. Kirk here, and today we're going to make a penguin penny bank. You're going to need an empty plastic bottle of any size, scissors, hot glue or some kind of tape, white and black paint, orange and black foam or paper, string, felt or some kind of fabric to make a scarf and hat, and maybe even some fun googly eyes if you don't want to just draw on your own. Note, if you're doing this with a small child, make sure that you're the one doing all the steps that require the use of a knife or scissors. Are you ready? Here we go! First, we're gonna take our water bottle, and if there's a label on it, you just wanna take that off. We don't wanna see that, we wanna see a penguin! Then, we're gonna cut a slit in the top of the bottle, right near the middle, just like this. You wanna make sure that that's big enough that you can put some change in later. All right. Now, we're gonna paint two thirds of this bottle with black paint. It should look like this. You see how there's lots of black on one side and clear on the other? That's what you want. The black should go on the side with the hole for the change. And you might wanna make sure to put on two coats if you want it to look nice and dark. After that's dry, we're gonna paint the clear part of the bottle with the white paint. Once your white paint is on, set that aside to dry, and we're gonna make all of the other fun penguin parts like the feet, the beak, the wings, the scarf, the hat, you name it. You can draw your own, or you can use the patterns that we made for you. So first, let's make some wings. Take your black foam and draw or trace some penguin wings, and then go ahead and cut them out so that they look like this. You'll also wanna cut out a little rectangle that we can use as the head of the penguin, right from that same black foam. Now that those are cut out, get your orange foam. On the orange foam, you wanna draw or trace some cute little penguin feet and a little triangle beak. Once they're drawn on, go ahead and cut them out too, and they'll look like this. So cute. All right, let's get to building our penguin. So first, now that our penguin is dry, we're gonna take that black strip that we cut and we're gonna wrap it around so it can be the head of the penguin. Go ahead and glue that together right in the back there. Now, take our wings and we're gonna put them on the side, just like this. Go ahead and glue those on too. So cute. All right, now we're gonna put the feet on our penguin. So go ahead and line up your feet right at the bottom of your cute little penguin bottle. And go ahead and glue them on. Oh, it's starting to look like a penguin already. All right. Now, from felt or fabric, we're gonna cut out a rectangle to make a hat. Wrap it around like this to make a cylinder and then glue it together. It'll look like this once you're done. Then take a piece of string and tie it right around the top. Make a nice knot and tie it tight. Go ahead and make another knot to make sure that that's not gonna go anywhere. Awesome! You can use the scissors to trim off any excess of the felt or the string. And then go ahead and glue that hat, your eyes, and your beak to your penguin. Almost done! The last thing you wanna do is take a nice long thin piece of felt or fabric and use it as a scarf to tie around the neck of the penguin. Go ahead and glue that together and once you're all done, your penguin should look 
like this. Oh, isn't it great? Look at this adorable penguin that you can even use to save money for a rainy day. Awesome! Now, go and watch Swim, Learn, and Play on Maestro's Magical Music Box and feel free to waddle along with your new penguin penny bank. Oh, I bet your penguin penny bank looks so great. Make sure to share it with your family and hop on over to our website to share it with us by sending a picture or a video. Until we meet again, this is Mr. Kirk signing off. We have